This video is all about fixing CPU lag, boosting FPS, and eliminating micro stutters by disabling hidden window services, background features, and unnecessary system components that slow down your PC. Before applying these tweaks, many games constantly drop frames, stuttered during fights, and used way too much CPU in the background. But after making these changes, performance instantly became smoother, FPS stabilized, and input delay reduced noticeably. So make sure you watch this video till the end, and if this guide helps you out, don't forget to subscribe and drop a like, it really helps the channel grow. We'll begin by disabling unnecessary third-party services that silently run in the background and drain CPU power. Open the Windows search bar, type System Configuration, and open it. Inside the window, go to the Services tab. Before doing anything, tick the box that says Hide All Microsoft Services. This is extremely important because it prevents you from disabling anything that Windows needs to run. After hiding Microsoft Services, you'll see only third-party services. Things like update checkers, cloud sync tools, media servers, printer utilities, or leftover software you don't even use. These services automatically run on startup and consume CPU cycles without you realizing it. Once done, click Apply, hit OK, and restart your PC. After the restart, you'll have fewer unnecessary processes running, which immediately improves CPU performance and FPS stability. Next, we're going to disable hidden Windows services that run quietly in the background and increase CPU usage. Open the search bar again, type Services, and open the Services app. This window lists every background process managed by Windows. The first one you should disable is Connected User Experiences and Telemetry. This service constantly collects usage data and sends it to Microsoft. It doesn't help gaming in any way and consumes resources. Right-click it, open Properties, set Startup Type to Disabled, click Stop, then Apply and OK. If you don't use a printer, find Print Spooler, open its properties, disable it, stop it, and apply the change. Windows Error Reporting Service is another process that runs frequently and can cause random stutters during gaming sessions because it logs crashes and sends reports to Microsoft. Disabling it prevents those interruptions. If you don't use remote desktop features, you can disable remote desktop services, remote registry, and remote desktop configuration. These reserve resources even when inactive. For users who don't use Bluetooth devices, you can also disable the Bluetooth support service. Just make sure you're not using any Bluetooth keyboard, mouse, controller, or headphones. Another one worth turning off is the Program Compatibility Assistant Service, which is designed for very old software and rarely needed today. And finally, disabling Windows Search can drastically reduce CPU usage on low-end PCs because this service continuously indexes your files. The only downside is that searching for files becomes slightly slower, but for gaming performance, the trade-off is worth it. Now let's disable unnecessary Windows features that also increase CPU usage. Open the search bar and type Windows Features, then click Turn Windows Features On or Off. A list will appear with optional components. We are going to disable the ones that aren't needed for gaming. Features like Hyper-V, Windows Sandbox, Virtual Machine Platform, and Windows Subsystem for Linux are all related to virtualization, and if you don't use virtual machines, they only waste resources. Internet Information Services and its subcomponents are made for hosting websites and are useless for gaming. The Microsoft XPS Document Writer and Print and Document Services are no longer needed unless you use a printer. Old networking features like Simple TCP slash IP Services SMB 1.0, Telnet Client, and TFTP Client can also be turned off safely. After unchecking all these unused features, click OK and let Windows apply the changes. Restart your PC when prompted. When your system restarts, you'll immediately notice lower CPU usage, faster program loading, and smoother FPS during gaming. Now let's add two extra optimizations that can boost performance even further. The first one is disabling core isolation, also called memory integrity. This security feature adds virtualization overhead that increases CPU latency and lowers overall performance in games. To turn it off, open Windows Security from the search bar, click on Device Security, then open Core Isolation Details. Turn memory integrity off and restart your PC. 
This instantly reduces CPU overhead and helps stabilize FPS, especially on mid-range and low-end systems. The next optimization is disabling HPET, also known as the High Precision Event Timer. HPET is an older hardware timer that often causes inconsistent frame pacing and increased input delay when Windows forces it. To disable it, right-click the Start button, open Device Manager, scroll down to System Devices, and find High Precision Event Timer. Right-click it and choose Disable. After restarting your PC, your system will switch to faster timers that provide smoother frame delivery and reduced input lag. By applying all of these optimizations, you remove unnecessary CPU load, stop background processes from stealing performance, and free up system resources so your games can run at maximum potential. This helps fix CPU bottlenecks, reduce stutters, boost FPS, and make your PC feel significantly faster and more responsive. If this video helped you fix CPU lag and boost FPS, make sure to drop a like and subscribe for more optimization guides. And if you want a full advanced PC optimization pack, comment FPS Boost and I'll share it with you.